Can Ukraine ensure the democratic integrity of its elections? I think ensuring democratic integrity of elections is a challenge every time we face it. But I think Ukrainians are doing better and better job with every iteration that they have. I think there is a greater understanding than any time before in Ukrainian history that uh, if elections are being meddled with, that has incredible effect after the elections, regardless who gets the uh, immediate win. Uh, because that affects the institutional trust level, that affects the efficiency of the administration. In the end, that affects whether people will simply consider the uh, authorities legitimate. And I think that um, electoral process as such is becoming more and more complex and sophisticated with every elections in Ukraine. Are economic reform proposals of the leading candidates addressing key economic needs? I think what the candidates are trying to do is to uh, suit the fashions, to say, or the um, publicly expressed needs of uh, the voters. And I think that can come uh, at a disadvantage uh, to actually the long-term economic interest of the same voters. Not every time what the voters want is uh, what they actually express. And then depending how accountable or unaccountable will be politicians for good uh, later on, we'll see um, how economy uh, prospers. You see, if the um, politicians are saying that, for instance, they want to undermine the independence of the central bank. And the question is whether they are actually going to do that. If they say that they sympathize to the poor, the question is, are they going to increase social spending or not? Uh, what we see in Ukraine that um, there are candidates who have the previous track record of uh, uh, populist moves, um, and that includes all of the um, leading candidates. But there are also some of the leading candidates also at the same time have the track record of actually doing unpopular and needed moves. Uh, so uh, I would say that electoral promises and, elec and post-electoral performance, especially in economic policy, are not directly connected. How will the elections impact resolution of the conflict in the East? I don't think that the results of the Ukrainian elections um, except for the situation if Ukrainians, for instance, decide to vote in a way that would end the Ukrainian independence, would actually affect the conflict as such, because the reasons, the causes for the conflict are beyond Ukraine. They're not in Ukraine, they're in Russia. But I think what the results of the elections will do is they will show how well Ukraine can actually deal with the crisis on hand, and will show how well Ukraine is able to cope, how well Ukraine is able to uh, increase its resilience, improve its um, uh, defense or uh, other sector uh, sectors uh, that are, uh, in this case, uh, critical for Ukraine's overall success.